right, we just got to the park. There's one other car here. It's a kid in the playground. Fix an exit playground. Here's my truck. We just got out. Uh, he is uh, a little bit excited, but he's doing pretty good. Uh, we got the Halty on. It's our first outing. We packed with the Halty at home a couple of times, two or three times. And uh, going to see how it does on the outings. I'm hoping it's going to make him a lot easier to control. For most dogs, it is. So we're just kind of settling. I'm giving him a minute to just kind of sniff around if he wants to, use the bathroom. A lot of dogs get excited and use the bathroom right away. A little bit muddy. Ooh. But if he gets to be too much, I'm, no, you're, I'm gonna, there you go, shake off that excitement. I'm going to just go ahead and reel him in. And we're going to go and start doing leash leadership right off the bat because he's getting a little bit out of control. And I don't want to give him a chance to get a lot out of control. Hey, 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 hey. Remember me? Yes, thank you. Just reminding him that we're doing leash leadership as usual. Always in the leash is short. Leash leadership. There we go. This is a quiet park. I come here on purpose for the first outing because just the new location for a lot of dogs is enough stimulus. Um, there's usually a person or two here, but it's not super crowded. Hey, 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 stop pulling me. All right, get together. A lot of dogs are excited like this at first. It takes them about five minutes to kind of settle in. So I will take some more videos along the way and see if he, he does that, which I'm hoping he will. All right. All right. He settled down a good bit and uh, how much he's pulling. Hey, sweetheart. So I gave him a little free time here. He just, just peed. Good job, honey. And um, he's been pretty nice about not pulling here lately. Go this way, honey. Here comes a person jogging. Let me get to the side here. Come here, honey. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. All right. Hey, how you doing? Good. All right. All right. Good job, buddy. You gave me a little bit of trouble, but it wasn't too bad. Here you go. I want him to always have positive people go by. Good job, huh? Well, I said somebody was here jogging, so that kind of caught me by surprise. Doing pretty good. I'm having to get on him a little bit here lately as he's walking too close to me. He's like leaning against my leg. So what I'm doing is I'm just pushing him off with my leg to give me some space. Alright, we're about halfway around the park. He's been walking really nicely. A second ago he tried to drag me to a tree like right like that. Pull him back and tell him that wasn't okay. For the most part, I could actually walk him with two fingers if I wanted to. Because I could pull it out of my hand. So he's definitely settling down, which they usually do after a few minutes. And uh, I stopped to so remember to sit. The jogger came by us one more time. Hey, Bailey. Remember? Yeah. And he, he gets excited when the jogger comes by. Like it's not aggressive, it's excited. It's just, I think, excited. Like, hey, somebody's running. That's exciting. I want to go run too, or meet him, or something. But I'm just taking him to the side, you know, just over the border of the, the path, and have him sit while the jogger goes by. Maybe I'll get a video next time. All right. We have pretty much walked around the whole park. About a half a mile. The jogger didn't come back by again. I think he just went around twice and then get ready to leave. Yeah, he's pulling his car's pulling out now. Let's send him back to our truck. What I want to do though is I'm going to walk him over here and walk him through the sand over here in the volley volleyball court. Uh, it's good to have dogs walk on different kinds of surfaces. Oh, let's see how they get the car going by here. I forgot how the car going by is an issue. All right. Going well, pretty slowly. <laughs> Good job, buddy. Yay! That's exactly right. You're supposed to sit. Good boy. That wasn't a big challenge because it was going pretty slow, but still, it was a little bit of a challenge. Okay, 
I like to have dogs walk in the sand. It's a different surface. A lot of dogs have not been on sand before. They can bring out, bring out the playful puppy in them or they can just not care at all. And of course, he's not super young, so hopefully he's had experience walking on all kinds of surfaces. But it's just a good thing with dogs is to practice walking on everything besides just grass and concrete and asphalt. Oh yeah, he's no, no, no issue here. Good job, buddy. Now, I would normally, at this point, take a dog out to the playground over here and walk him around the equipment, but since there's a kid here playing on it, uh, I'm not going to do that right now. We'll do it another time, one of our outings. Yay, look at you being good. I said, I don't know what to do. I should sit and look at Valerie. That's exactly right. Now, this is not my favorite brand of head halter he has on. Um, I don't have one that I like that fits him. So I'm having to use an alternative brand. This is called the Gentle Leader. And the reason I don't like it is because it doesn't have a safety strap. So I'm having to rig my own safety strap to attach to his collar. Um, and it just doesn't fit uh, snugly. It's constantly, the dog pulls, it constantly goes sideways and it kind of gets up toward his eye. Uh, the brands that I like are Halty and um, Train, was it Walk and Train? They have a safety strap and they kind of have extra uh, material that keeps the halty in place and from sliding around and up into their eye. So I'm going to go online today and see if I can find some and get some on order. So I want you to have one when he comes home. Water? Let's drink a little bit of water. I thought you drink more than that though. As you probably are aware if he drinks, he drinks a lot, which a lot of labs do. All right. But I always give dogs a drink of water when we get back in the truck. Of course, you're making you make it a mess. Is that all you want? All right. We're only about probably 10 minutes, or if even that, from my house. So we'll be back home soon. He can get a drink of water when he gets there.